Yo, what's up everybody? Uh, it's been a while since Anime Expo had happened. You know, it's been a few years. Um, but I think the last time we did it, I kind of, I did a video where I kind of walked around the show floor before it opened to everybody because uh, I really enjoy doing that, you know, enjoy checking everything out. That's one of my favorite things. I don't know what it is. I always um, love checking out uh, convention show floors before they open. There's something about that, like, vibe, you know? It's like the calm before the storm kind of thing. And I don't know. I've always enjoyed it. Anyway, I, I probably talked about all that a few years ago, but I think I mentioned it's always, you know, quiet and nice. But I have to say this year, kind of bucks that trend like some of these booths are loud as hell and they already are <laughs> you got to see this whole i just want to you know look around show you some stuff you got to see this bandai booth look how big this is i feel like uh i feel like since everything kind of reopened and stuff a lot of conventions the booths aren't back to being like spectacular yet until this con or i'm actually seeing like incredible displays like look at this that's that's a whole ass one piece boat dude what's the name of that boat i can't remember i read like the first vol few volumes of, i check into one piece now and then but i don't remember the name of this boat but look at this, seriously, look at this Bandai Pavilion. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to walk in there, photo. This Gundam booth, the design is just really cool. So like I said, it's significantly louder towards the center of the show floor, but once you get away from that, it kind of gets quiet again. And uh, just want to say real quick, masks are required on the show floor. So anybody being like, yo, why are you wearing that? There's a fucking reason. Okay. So don't. The, spare the comment. I'm just going to mute your ass anyway. All right. Anyway. I don't actually know what this is. What does obey me? Isn't that a band or something? Or is that a... Uh, what band is it? There's some band that have, they have an exclamation mark in their name. Like Beneath Me or something me. What is that? Why is that in my brain? I think this is kind of a dope long sleeve. Isn't that cool? I kind of like that. Anyway. I don't know if this is Hype Land or Hip Land, but either way, they got a huge presence here. Donches here, I believe they pretty sure they own Attack on Titan. I don't know how that relationship works, but I'm pretty sure the anime that's their thing. I love the name of this. A couple of cuckoos. I don't know if this video is going to get me uh, copyright claimed out of existence, but uh, doing my best.
this uh this booth is kind of kind of wild like look at this going on this train or something I'm saying this I'm saying this in a complimentary way I it it doesn't look like they had some professional make this you know what I mean it looks like uh, it was put together by a team that maybe this wasn't their specialty that they they wanted to have a train but and I say that as a compliment because it, it gives me Mystery Science Theater vibes in a good way. I would rather see this than some like way too polished booth. You know what I mean? Like just some corporate thing. This has like handwork in it. it you know, I really like it. Okay, we're, now we we're kind of more towards the uh, front of the booth or uh, the, of the hall, but here's kind of what it's more, like more in the center. sure if uh i'm not sure if they're running it right now because again it is still fairly early but uh i really got to hand it to game grumps they have a booth here and they really doubled down on uh making it look like the type of booth you would see at an anime convention like every every uh cliche that you can imagine I, I, in a good way let me uh i don't know if it's around here i don't know if i stumble across it'll point it out but otherwise Some, at some point here, I want to swing by uh, the Evangelion store is here from Japan, the official Eva store. And uh, I raided that place yesterday, man. I, they, they didn't have nothing left when I got out of there. Those guys got an unexpected weekend off. Um, so I might swing by there, see if they got anything left. You know, maybe they restocked or something. There we go. Okay, here's the Game Grumps booth. This is what I was talking about. I don't know if there's anybody there right now. This is awesome. Getting a little closer to where our booth is. Exactly. 
Okay, this is a shirt that I've seen at every convention since like 2016, and it's right across from our. But we've been looking at this all weekend. really interesting you know again a lot of conventions as I mentioned before that have come back have kind of tiptoed their way there and not all the not all the booths have come back I think a lot of companies are just you know nervous maybe that's a more of a game industry thing you know they they're not all the way back in but here it really feels like mostly a hundred percent back the way it was maybe maybe the biggest one yet Okay, we got we to gotta see if the Ava booth restocked. We have to look. Let's just see what happens. I don't, I don't know what this is, but this booth is adorable. never seen the full-size Jiren before that's dope okay this is the Ava store let's see if they got new stuff in because I may I may be paying them another visit mm -hmm. okay so that is a negative those shelves are looking pretty bare and again I'm gonna take credit for it I, I came in there I look like I was uh, winning uh, Toys R Us uh, sweepstakes on Nickelodeon. I was just taking the full arm, pushing it all in my cart. Okay, I have to say, some people are asking me, what's my most anticipated figure that hasn't come out yet that I'm waiting on? Here they are, all, all of them. The Darkstalkers... Uh, situation first of all we need a new game so capcom if you're watching that's priority one but second these statues are, are too dope so we got we got to get this going i think morgan is uh yeah morgan is later this month so i'm very excited oh i gotta get my is my is here okay my is on the list um i really like this wolverine Okay, comic. All you comic nuts. Wait, this came out in December? I've never... How have I never seen this? Who is Laura Kinney? That's not X-23 or whatever, is it? Who's Laura Kinney? Why does it say that? Oh, that's Megatron? Oh, these are... These are Transformers? Wow. That's, that's kind of... That's kind of amazing. Um, shouts out Toei Animation. They got some good ass merch at this booth. I've, I've stopped here multiple times to pick stuff up. Look at this Toei Animation gear. Look at this. Oh my god. Yo, how's it going? I'm just showing. I'm showing them on video. What's that? Oh, oh, thank you. Yeah, I did. That's right. I got the shorts at this booth, so I got to show some of this stuff off because. I mean, anything with the Toei animation, like old school logo and all that stuff, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be drooling. Up. Oh no, oh no, I already, I already broke the pants. The I don't know how, to, I'm so you? sorry. Oh, you're good, man. These, those kind of hangers have always defeated me, you know? But thank you guys so much for bringing such good stuff. No, thank you, we really appreciate it, man. Dude, can't, I, I'm loving all the, uh, what are they, hexagons? I'm loving all the hexagons. Yeah, the honeycomb style. I'm seeing a lot of them and I like it. Yeah. <laughs> Awesome. All right, you guys have a good one. Yeah. Yeah. That was so embarrassing. I've got... uh -oh. Okay, okay, we got to get show ready. We got to get show ready.
Okay, we're gonna get show ready in, in just a second. I'm gonna and, and what better place to end our little excursion? Let's, let's take it back home. Let's take it back to the place we've always belonged. Here it is. Our home away from home, the Mega 64 booth. Look at all the stuff we got on display. Actually, this is all covered up, so you can't see it. But I'm very, I come back here. We've been doing booths at events and stuff for a long time, but... I'm never not proud when I walk up in the morning and see all our stuff. And I'm like, dude, we did that, you know? Well, we didn't just do a bunch of shirts, but you know, there's a lot of stuff commemorated. Normally this is playing videos and stuff. Normally uh, there's a lot more activity, but got all this artwork. It's just, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm stoked. Every time I walk up, I'm like, yeah, this is our thing, you know? <laughs> As opposed to it's not our thing. I don't know, anyway. Well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this little walkthrough. Um, I don't know if it's like if that's like valuable content, but I always like doing it, so I did it. Damn, we're sold out of a lot of stuff. Damn, we're looking like at the Ava store right now. All right, which one of you Evangelion staff members swept our booth? Post in the comments if it was you. Thank you. Good night. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, sorry, that wasn't good enough. This one's better.